It's time for food. And we are going to France, y'all. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh, good. I won't be able to talk for a few minutes. Maybe that's why you like these so much. I won't talk so much. They look like truffles. Oh, Chip more cookie. refined. They smell like feet. That would actually probably go good with a glass of wine. As long as I can taste the wine more than this, I'd be happy. Taste how makeup smells. It's chewy. Do you have any de new dental work? He does. You took a year of French. What does this mean? Um, I think it might be time for a drink. Yeah, that's that's sour. Garlic is gonna come out of your pores for like three days after mm. that. Guess what time it is? It's time for food. This time we are going to France, y'all. <laughs> We're gonna go to France. I've never been. You have. I've not. We. Oui. <laughs> we. Oui, oui. <laughs> Universal Yums doesn't know who we are, but we did purchase this box here. It was from a couple months back. We don't know what's inside, but we're gonna give you a quick, um, I guess, look into what Universal Yums gave us from France. We're gonna try some new snacks. Are you excited? Totally. I'm hungry. I'm also a little you? hungry. So yeah, yeah, we were both thinking we were both really, really hungry, so we gotta try this. It's getting snacky. What can I get? Something from France. Mm. And as per usual, you get a little map and it's packaged mm. really, really nicely. Always stickers. It's a really great box for a family. You can play games, little bits about what's inside. We're just going to dive into so it. So I emptied out the whole box and kind of did a, like little sections. It's a chestnut spread. And I'm wondering, it's just a good spread. one toast or something? Or maybe some of the biscuits. Maybe. I don't know. Interesting. <laughs> I mean, it's sweet. It can definitely tell. It's like Sweet. It just says chestnuts. 50% of this is chestnuts, sugar, candy, marrons, glucose syrup, water, vanilla essence, Madagascar. So Madagascar vanilla is a hazelnut spread, it looks like, or some sort of paste that maybe you can add to baking. Let's start off with the yum bag. Basically, this is one of those grab bags. They generally put them in this box. This is the largest box they sell. So you get, I think, up to 15 items. I'm looking right now. I think we're close to 15 items. So there's a whole bunch of things, but I'm just gonna dump it out here. And it looks Ooh, like there's- There's this thing. And it looks like popcorn truffle. And yeah. then it looks like a caramel. It looks like a truffle. Package looks like it's supposed to have like popcorn. Yep. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Oh, good. popcorn. Mm -hmm. That's delicious. Mmm. Mm -hmm. That's that's very, very good. So that's delicious. truffles, salted caramel, and popcorn. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Delicious. And then mm. we have these, which looks like a really nice ooey gooey caramel. Cheers. I won't be able to talk for a few minutes. Maybe mm. that's why you like these so much. I won't talk so much. Yes. Oh, that's pretty good. I like mm -hmm. the truffle thing better. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which is saying something because we both like caramel. But yeah, that's good. Two thumbs up. So we're gonna try the butter biscuit. It is a butter biscuit, but can the French do biscuits better than the English? Sounds like a fighting word there. I, I know, know, right? Mm -hmm. It smells rich. It's like butter. In France, they use so much butter, so that does make sense. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Very flaky. Mm. That's a good biscuit. It's a biscuit. Mm -hmm. Nice buttery. Nice mm -hmm. buttery flavor. Mm -hmm. Mini roll. That's next. Has a picture of a raspberry in front of it, which you. I do love my raspberry. Love raspberry. <laughs> oh, it's a raspberry roll. Oh, it really is. It literally is a roll. It is literally a roll. It looks like a fig Newton, but just on steroids. Nice and fluffy, actually. It's really, like, it's soft. It's like it's made fresh. I actually preferred yep. the other biscuit. This is something you would love because you love raspberry. It's kind of like a fresh fig Newton, but with raspberry. Good. Yep. Let's try these truffle things. So this is supposed to be truffles and co cookies. I'm not sure if the cookies themselves are infused with truffles versus chocolate chips. They oh, look like truffles. truffles. Cheers. 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 That's mm. exactly what it is. A cookie inside. Very smooth. Delicious. Oh, it's really good. So compared yeah, yeah. to the other truffle that we tried, that one there, yeah. these ones here, yeah. this one was like full of whatever is in the center. You know, in a chocolate chip cookie, you get more cookie and a little bit of chocolate chips. Yep. This you get the chocolate chip with a tiny little bit of cookie inside. There's just yep. only essence of crunch. Good. Essence of crunch. You got some crisps. Mm. This one looks interesting. It's potato chip flavor with goat cheese and espalel, sorry, a chili pepper. The pitcher is, mm. my mouth is watering. It looks so good. I cheese. love cheese. Well. Maybe don't judge the smell because it's cheese. It's definitely Keeping cheese. You definitely smell the cheese. Nope. Like real cheese is what it smells like. It does. It smells like real cheese. It smells like feet. Cheers. Cheers. That would actually probably go good with a glass of wine. 
as long as I could taste the wine more than this, I'd be happy. I think it's the cheese. The shovel. Let's just put it this way. Nelson has no sense of taste <laughs> left because he just doesn't, or a sense of smell. I'm a little more sensitive in, in that area. No good. I like them. It's yeah, very goat go. cheesy. Violet flavored gummies, which I know violet in fragrance, like personal fragrance is big in France. And in makeup, if you smell that makeup smell, normally it's the smell of violet. Yeah, it's, it's like it's a wine like gum. It's like a wine gum. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Cheers. Tastes like violet. Tastes how makeup smells. Not a fan. Artificially flavored. And kind of chemically Definitely. Uh, flavored. Bulls Cara. And then there's a picture of a caramel. So they're in like these little balls. And in Canada, they look very similar to a scotch mint. But I don't think that that's what they are. I think they're actually caramel balls. Oh, they're the powdered sugar yeah, on it? Yeah, powdered sugar. Cheers. Oh, actually, I don't break your teeth or your jaw. It's Joey. It's kind of buttery. It looks as though they make a lemon, a green apple, and a strawberry version of this as well. Strawberry bonbon chewy candy. More chewy. Bonbon. These look exactly like the other ones. The ones, ones we, we just, just had. Oh, yeah. Pretty much as chewy as the last one. Yep. But I like this one better. I have to warm up. I guess that makes sense because remember I told you that it comes in strawberry, lemon, and green apple? Oh, there you go. If you have any de new dental work, <laughs> he does. Yeah, it took some time to get into her, but yeah. His strawberry is better than the original one that we had, I think. Probably. Let's go healthy. Mm -hmm. And we're going to do a bread O. Looks to be a bagel chip. It says bread chip, spinach, cheese, and garlic. All things I love. A little bit broken, but that's chips. Right. So as you can see, it's got all the, the stuff on there. It's got some garlic. I can definitely smell a little bit of garlic. Eh, it's oh. not bad. I like these. I can't really taste it. La Palais de la Mer Poulard. You took a year of French. What does I, this mean? Um, the Palace of the, the, the Ocean. 1888 cookie, similar to the cookie, the butter cookie that we have. But this one is supposed to be shortbread. Get quite a few in here to get oh, two cool. packs of these. I'm feeling this is like a, a lemon version. These ones are a little thicker. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I can smell the lemon. You like lemon. Mm. It's a good cookie. The subtle flavor of lemon. It's good. I think it might be time for a drink. So when you purchase this larger size box, you're always guaranteed a drink of some kind. So this is the Orangina. Orangina. So I'm assuming it's like an orange soda. The size of like one of those Japanese coffees you get, which are, by the way, freaking amazing. Mm, well, ASMR. I thank you. Welcome. Smells orangey. Bubbly orange juice. Yeah, it's not bad. Not bad. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. it's okay. So up next we have another chip. This is honey mustard chips, which is not uncommon here in Canada. You can get honey mustard chips, honey mustard dips. That is really good. Yeah, I've never had a chip like that before. That was really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tastes like more. Oh yeah. Yeah. Two thumbs up. Oh, yes. Up next we have some sour cherry candies that we're going to try. I don't think they're chewy. I love sour candy. We'll be working on this one for a little while. Yeah, that's, that's sour. No pain, no gain. I like sour candy. Once you get through the sour portion, it's actually put in a lovely cherry. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, mm -hmm. it's quite quite a bit better now. Mm -hmm. The second to last item is another potato chip in aioli. Mm. So it looks like got a picture of a like a garlic. I'm gonna cool, cool. sense that it's gonna have a lot of flavor. I'm hoping. After that sour cherry candy, it's gonna go real well. It's like orange juice and brushing your teeth. Oh, garlic. Cheers. Oh yeah, there's definitely garlic in there. Cheers. Pink. Wow. I like it. Garlic is gonna come out of your pores for like three days after mm. that. But it's good. Big, big fan of garlic. You like garlic? That's the chip to Delicious. Last but not least is a dark chocolate 47% with sea salt crystals in it. Now, France does a very good job of chocolate as we've yep. already obviously yep. found out. Cheers. Merci beaucoup. Mmm, the sea salt is in the inside. Normally, a lot of times the chocolate, chocolatiers would put on the top. It's a lot of dark chocolate, just a hint of, of um, sea, salt. sea salt. And it's only 47% dark chocolate. Really? So yeah, it does taste, it, to me it tastes actually darker. Yeah, yeah. But that's probably because I'm more of a milk chocolate fan, but I can appreciate dark chocolate. It was good, but it was probably not my favorite. Yeah, it's not so, bad. And then again, they've got lots of recipes that you can use. It's a fun box that we're doing. Again, if we go away traveling, we bring back foods and snacks from wherever we traveled. But this time, we didn't go to France, but France came to us. So even if you can't go, uh, you know, visiting other countries, 
let countries come to visit you. Exactly. So if you liked it, smash that like button and come hit your ride with us. Woohoo! Check your thumb. I have a picture. You don't have. I have it. Yeah, I have. Mm-hmm. <laughs>